guys, this is a $5,000 starter bread recipe. The story behind this recipe is a seafood master from China wanted to start a recipe so bad he spent about $5,000 just to find it. So far, it's my family's most favorite and reminds them of the rolls sold at Chinese bakeries. And big thanks to Linda for sharing this recipe with me. In a large bowl, add in the yeast, handful of the bread flour to feed the yeast, add in some of the water just enough to dissolve the yeast, mix this with a whisk or a fork until it dissolves, add in the rest of the bread flour, add in the cake flour, and the sugar. Add in the rest of the water, stir it until this comes together, and cover and let this rise until it has a honeycomb like texture. This takes about 1 to 3 hours. For the main dough recipe, you basically combine together all these ingredients I listed under main dough, egg, water, sugar, bread flour, cake flour, salt, and milk powder. It's okay if it looks a little sad and lumpy, just add in the starter now and knead this for 6-8 to eight minutes. Use a timer if you need to, it'll be pretty exhausting but you can throw it into a kitchen egg mixer with a dough hook attachment if it's too much. Cover and let this rise for 1-3 to three hours until it doubles in size. Release the gas in the dough by gently punching down the dough and kneading any excess. Divide the dough in half, taking one of the pieces, roll it into a log, and divide it into four pieces. Roll each of the pieces into a rope. Use flour as needed. Tie one of the ropes into a knot. I like to move it so the legs are dangling and I tuck one of the legs under and the other legs over into the center. And just showing you again, tie it into a knot, dangle the legs, tuck one leg over and the other leg under. Place this in either an 8x8 inch square brownie pan or an 8 inch circle pan while greased with oil. Let it rise until double in size, covered loosely with saran wrap, and be sure to give it enough room to rise in the pan. Make an egg wash with 1 tablespoon of water mixed into 1 egg. Brush onto the buns. Be sure to get all the sides by turning the pan around to face you. Bake at 350 degrees Fahrenheit for 30 minutes. Melt 2 tablespoons of butter in the microwave at 15 seconds intervals. Brush onto the hot bread generously. I think doing this softens the crust, gives it this yummy glow, and adds to the taste, but feel free to skip this step. I let my bread cool down completely before moving from the pan. You can like let it cool down to warmish. I run a knife on the edges very gently and just flip the bread over. It should come out very easily as long as you sprayed the pan with oil. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe. Be sure to comment down below for any questions that you have. Follow me on my social media sites. Watch my previous video. And let me know what you would like to see next for my next tutorial or any video in general. And bye!